My mother always used to say, if I didn't have anything nice to say, don't say anything at all. Thankfully, my good friend Nibbles... hi Hello, Nibbles! Hello, Narrator! And I so don't believe in that! Um, before I ask about what you're holding there... Uh-huh? How'd your, uh, the yaks date? Um, with the, the girlfriends? You said you were going to order the lobster, skip out, and that horribly beat them? We ordered the lobster, and they went and powdered their nose and never came back. They beat the team that badly? Yep. Never underestimate the power of a girl looking for free food. Um, Nibs? Anyway... So, I, you wanted to know about this. Um, yes. This is a thermometer. Uh, a thermometer. A thermometer. It measures my thumbs. You sure? Yep. See, we're up against team meningitis. Well, I'm pretty sure it's meningitis. They, they appear to have misspelled it. It's an inflammation of the brain and can cause delusions and fevers, and I need to know if I have it. Why is that so important, Nibs? Because when I look at the teams and I realize just how badly the yaks are going to obliterate the meningitis, I, considering their disease-carrying potential, I like to check my temperature and make sure that I am not feverish and delusional. And so far, every time I say that we are going to horribly stomp you, I'm not getting a fever. So I'm pretty sure I am not horribly delusional. And any chance you think you have is just an outcome of you being bedridden and having a ridiculous fever and wanting to have lots of soup and uh, maybe some uh, verners and just sit down and relax and let the sweet hallucinations fly over your head as you're seeing animated picket fences fighting each other. Um, that's... It works! And then eventually they'll come too. But apparently we have a team of disease and I want to make sure that their contagion is not influencing my judgment. I see. So, um, that's kind of, how's your diet going? Diet? Yeah, you know, your mom wanted to make, oh, yeah. I have, uh, been eating a lot more apples lately. It had been weeks since I had eaten grass. You eat grass? Grass haze and other things. Oh, like when I was a kid, it's all fun and joyful and I like to bounce around and eat it and just then just burrow in a big pile of it, fling it all in the air, go wee, kind of like playing in a leaf pile that I know humans do, but then you get to eat the leaf pile! I see you've rediscovered some joys of some of these foods. Yep, I still like climbing in Cheetos bags, and Mom's okay with that as long as we clean them out first and there's no Cheeto dust. It's just not as much fun without the Cheeto dust, but I'm working on it! I am working to be a responsible, healthy guinea pig. Anyway, I need to go and make sure that I'm not being delusional. And I'm going to head off to some political convention and check all their temperatures, too, because they sounded delusional last I heard. Um, which uh, political party? Whichever one is the opposite of the viewer. You're really going for the non-controversial... Everyone thinks everyone's delusional in politics. It's how it works. Boop, 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 boop.